Hello and welcome uh, to another random video on MotoGP 17. Uh, today we're going to be talking about something else in the menu today. Yes, it's going to be another menu, MotoGP 17. I know that some of these random videos might be on um, uh, on races as well, uh, but I thought we could do some in the menu as well because we'll be doing like menu videos as well uh, because I know that I have done a few bike setup videos as well. So um. Yeah, so today we're going to be talking about something else in the menu today. Uh, so basically, last week I talked about the, uh, the MyGP. Uh, so I kind of uh, just went through all the MyGP uh, settings. I uh, went through all of those, how to customise your own rider and stuff like that. Uh, so that's kind of the one. Uh, so today, uh, we're going to be talking about split screen. Uh, so basically, this is a bit of a weird one to talk about because I don't mainly use split screen on MotoGP. Uh, and there's a couple of reasons why. Uh, number one is I don't have another controller. Um, so I don't have a, a second one. Uh, number two is I don't have uh, I don't have a friend to come over and play. And another re another reason is I just don't bother with it. Uh, so basically, I thought we could just talk about it in a little random video today of what split screen normally is. So the first question is, by the way, though, is um, have you guys played split screen before? That's the big question. If you um, if you guys if you guys played it before, like if you guys played against someone, uh, so I've not really used it. So basically, the way how split screen works is you have to connect up to a second controller. And so basically, it's it's a little bit different than Xbox Live because when you're on live, you can play online with random people. Uh, but when you're on split screen, you have to use another controller. Uh, so it is a little bit um, it's basically a little bit different. Uh, so basically, the way how it works is you have to connect to uh, another controller, and then basically the uh, the player that's uh, that's basically connected up, uh, he'll be able to. Um, yeah, he'll be able to, uh, to basically play uh, with, uh, um, uh, basically with you, by the way. Uh, because basically, if you do have another controller anyway, you need to make sure that you do uh, actually turn it on and you connect it up and, so and stuff like that. And then basically, when you've done that, you'll be able to get your race set up. You can pick any rider in the game, and then you can just go and race for fun um, um, as well. Uh, so I don't really know it exactly, just because I've not been on it. Uh, but I do know how split screen works, because I've, uh, I've, I've used split screen a few times in, in video games. Uh, so, for example, if I'm talking about uh, maybe the split second game what me and Nathan played uh, the other week, uh, we played on it on split screen, and apparently the way how I, d I, I did it on split screen is is like is Nathan connected his controller to the uh, to the uh, the, uh, the game, and basically we uh, we started playing. Uh, so that's kind of the uh, the way uh, it will work with MotoGP. Um, so there's a couple of things that you need to do, by the way. Uh, so you need to make sure your control is turned on, and you need to make sure that you uh, you press the button. So if I press the button here, it says here, uh, player two, press the menu button to select a controller, or press B on any control to exit split screen mode. So basically, what that means um, is it means basically if you are exiting out the um, the yeah, if you are exiting uh, exit, exiting out to split screen. Uh, so, for example, if you connect up to another uh, controller, uh, you'll be able to, to play. And if you're not, you have to press the B button uh, to be able to back out the split screen. And then that is uh, that is it. Uh, um, I have been on the split screen um, um, a few times. Uh, apparently, I think a really, really, really long time ago, I used to play with one of my friends on MotoGP. Uh, apparently, I used to play MotoGP with, uh, with one of my old friends. And uh, apparently, we... Um, it wasn't even that difficult to connect split screen up, to be honest. It wasn't even that difficult to play it up. And uh, basically what happened after that is, it's really easy to set it up. Only the thing that you need to do is you just need to make sure that you just connect it up to a right controller. Uh, and then when you've done that, you'll be able to, to connect it up completely. Uh, and then and then uh, you'll be able to play with the other people that you, uh, that you want to play. Uh, so you can play with uh, any uh, sort of one. So uh, I believe on split screen it works uh, like the same as Xbox Live, where you uh, you have all the tracks in it. You can beat any rider in it. Uh, like I've not really seen it, so uh, so I don't know what it looks like. Uh, but I believe I think it is the same as Xbox Live, uh, where basically you can pick uh, a track what the person has voted for, uh, and then so when you've done that, you'll be able to basically uh, pick the ones that you uh, that you want to do. Um, and uh, basically, uh, the ones that you've done, you uh, and then yeah, when you've uh, when you've done that, uh, you basically just get straight into the race, and then you are pretty much set up, and then uh, uh, whoever wins is the winner. Uh, so I believe I think you do get AIs on split screen. I'm not sure if you, uh, um, if you do, I don't know. So basically, the way how it works is you have um, you basically have you and the other person on the controller, uh, and you have the AIs. Uh, I believe you can turn the AIs off. I'm not sure if you can do that. I don't know, but I think you can turn it off uh, on them, and you can have a one v one between uh, the first uh, the first. Uh, controller guy and the second controller guy so basically they can go and battle it out uh, and see who's going to, to wait on it on any track 
as that's kind of the way how split screen works at the moment because uh, basically I've been using split screen for for quite a while now I've not been using it lately at home I've been using it a lot of Nathan's lately because uh, another me and Nathan have played a lot of games at the moment on, on his Xbox and we've done a lot of split screen on that as that's kind of the way how it uh, how it will work on, on uh, at home with me uh, but for example I don't usually do split screen anymore just because that like I don't like at some point like I probably will invite a friend over at some point and I will probably challenge them to a Moto GP split screen but like to be honest I don't really bother with that anymore just because that like basically like when I was a, a, a really really small child um I used to basically love going on split screen. I don't know why. I used to technically love playing on it, and then all of a sudden now it's been it's been grouched away, and then sad to say I've not I've not bothered with it anymore. So I didn't really bother with it anymore when I uh, uh, well when I got in uh, back into MotoGP, and I decided myself to just um, not mess about with it, and I just decided myself to just uh, just leave it and just do a career and all the stuff I can do on my own. Uh, and so, because uh, that Xbox Live is a bit better anyway, because you'll be able to basically race with people, because I've been doing a lot of online on MotoGP 17 now as well, uh, so I'll be able to basically race with the people that I want to race with. Um, and since the on online at the moment, we've had a lot and a lot, a lot, epic, uh, a lot and a lot of epic battles at the moment, especially, I know that there was some videos where I did crash, uh, there were some videos where I did have some epic victories and not some bad victories or something like that. So I do uh, love racing with other people online. It's just brilliant to be able to play. It's just be able to race with like random people online. It's just unbelievable. So you can battle it out between who's going to win and all that kind of thing. And that's kind of the, uh, the way how it will work with split screen. Uh, but at the moment with split screen, you'll be able to have uh, two... Um, vertical split uh yeah uh, uh, it'll basically be vertical uh, so it'll be one side and one side like that and then technically the way um it will uh, it will work is uh the one player will be on that side and he will be on that side um and uh, basically kind of the way it will work after that is uh basically who's who's the dominated champion who's going to be the, uh, the winner uh, to be able to see who's going to be the competitive at split screen uh, because at the moment I have been doing really well on split screen in the past. Like I think I, I think I think I technically won a few split screens. I'm not, I'm not sure if I won a lot. I don't know, but there's kind of a few that I did win, and then there were a few that I did lose, or something like that. Um, and also another funny thing I love about split screen is I was really really mardy as well. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I was um I was really mardy at split screen. I don't know why, because uh, apparently when uh, when my friend beat me, I just showed off and uh, and and got mad to myself. Um, and uh, yeah, I just, um, I think I just like threw up the control or something, I just lost or something, but I, I, I have changed now, I don't, I, like, I don't really do, uh, do that anymore, so for example, if I'm, if I'm doing a split screen right now and I get second place, oh, that'll, that'll do, I don't mind getting second place, like technically that's what we've been doing at Nathan's at the moment. Uh, so, for example, if me and Nathan play split screen and Nathan did win and I got about 8th place, uh, I'll say to myself, oh, never mind. I'll, I'll win the next one, and that next minute, back in the, uh, ba uh, uh, basically back in the olden days, um, oh, uh, I lost, uh, I shouldn't have not got that position, yeah, so, basically, that's what I was like, uh, back in the old days, that's what we're like, but now, I'm, I've, I've got a lot better, I've got a lot better at it now, and, for some reason at the moment, I don't do it as much anymore anyway, so, so uh, uh, I'm lost, I lost the game, or something like that, so, uh, and then, technically, at the moment, I don't really do that anymore anyway now, so, for example, um, if I did win, I'll go, yay, I won, and then back in the old days, I would go, yippee, yeah, something like that, so, yeah, so, I don't really, like, bother with it anymore anyway now. So, uh, yeah, a split screen is kind of like on the hold at the moment, um, so I might end up maybe coming back to it at some point, I'm not sure um, uh, whether that's going to happen, I don't know. Um, apparently split screen is really good though, uh, apparently if you guys do have the game and you do have maybe, if you have a brother or a sister or a friend coming over or something like that, uh, you'll be able to like challenge them to a race, it's quite easy to challenge people as well, uh, so you'll be able to like challenge the people that you want to challenge from and that, and then... Um, and then just say to myself, because I know there's kind of a lot of people out there that are not really into MotoGP, uh, because I know that at the moment there's, uh, I think there's kind of a lot of people that haven't been doing split screen lately, like, because there's kind of a lot of people out there that, that are into shooting games and they're not into motorbike games or something. So that's kind of a, what I've been doing at the moment. So that's why I've not been doing it as much anymore. Uh, but I think continually, when we do get some MotoGP, um, some new MotoGPs, I don't think I'm going to bother using it anymore, just because that we don't get as many people Um Anyways, but I've got to say that Xbox Live has got a bit more better, uh, just because I do get a lot more people uh, racing online, and I do get some more epic battles and stuff like that. Uh, but yeah, if you guys want to try split screen yourself on MotoGP, just go and do it right now. If you guys do have a friend or, 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 or whatever, uh, just go and challenge them to a race, put AIs on it, AIs off or anything, 
and uh, yeah just give us some tips in the comments below if you if you've ever done it or something but yeah it, it, was, it was basically just a thing that i wanted to talk about just because i haven't talked about it yet so i just wanted to just give you a bit of an update so i might do maybe another video on it support in the future uh but let's go find out so um uh, yeah, I think that's pretty much everything then that we need to talk about it, nothing really else. So, um, yeah, that's going to be the end of this week's random MotoGP 70 about split screen. So, there'll be another one in the menu coming up very soon, and also other ones uh, that I do on uh, races um, as well coming up uh, very, very soon um, as well, that, uh, which I will talk about. So, uh, so, so basically, next week, by the way, uh, will be Helmet Camera, and uh, basically, we're going to be starting a, a Time Attack series with my own riders. So, that's going to be the two MotoGPs uh, next week. So, there'll be another uh, random MotoGP 17 very, very soon. And I'll talk about something else. So thank you for watching this one. And I'll I'll see you very soon for the next one I'll talk about. Bye.